friends, welcome to Starfire Code's channeled messages. The dates on my readings are the dates on which they were channeled. All of my readings are meant to be timeless. Whenever they find you, that's when they are meant for you. This is a collective reading. If you have found your way here, I trust that there is something within this message that is meant for you. Please remember to take only what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this reading resonates with you and you would like to access the rest of the reading, which includes the tarot cards that were pulled, numerology, shuffle mancy, and often Claire audience, there is a link to the extended reading below in the description box. Extended readings are located on Substack at starfirecodes.substack.com. For a monthly or yearly fee, a subscription to my Substack will provide you with access to the extended archive of all of my readings. If you would like to book a personal reading, you may contact me at the email address in the description box below. I will never contact you in the comments section, and there is no other way to book a reading with me than to use the email address in the description box. Please do not get scammed by anyone pretending to be me or any other reader. Let's begin. Feeling complete and strong. Question. Individually, how is everyone doing? Can anyone say they are complete and strong? Serious question because I woke with this feeling of needing to come here and ask. Channeled message. We are always complete and strong. The problem is we perceive that we are not. Your connection to source is inside of you. You are always complete and strong. We are always learning what we are supposed to be learning. We are always being shown, even if sometimes we're not picking up whatever the universe is throwing down. Find ways to remind yourself as many times a day as possible that you are complete and strong because you are, and never doubt that. Your access to the divine is internal, not external. Take your power back. You are a mirror of me and I am a mirror of you, mirrored in the image of all, yes and holographic like Bentov, we are all source. When you ask God or source or whatever a question directed inward, not outward, you'll see a shift when you're no longer experiencing this as something leading you around outside of yourself. It's similar to the psychological idea of internal locus of control, but everything happening outside of you is governed by what is happening inside of you. So you can use the external to take the temperature of the energies that are presenting themselves at that time, but the questions you need to ask and the work you need to do is inward. Then you take action as an outward expression of that work and watch the action shift the energies. Use the energies to take the temperature again, lather, rinse, repeat. If this reading resonated with you and you would like to access the rest of the reading, which includes tarot cards that were pulled, numerology, shuffle mancy, and often clairaudience, there is a link to the extended reading below in the description box. Extended readings are located on Substack at starfirecodes.substack.com. For a monthly or yearly fee, a subscription to my Substack will provide you with access to the extended archive of all of my readings. If you would like to book a personal reading, you may contact me at the email address in the description box below. However, if this is where we leave each other, I wish you all the best, have a wonderful day, friends, and I'll see you next time.